Oh, right. Yeah. This is a Patreon request from Dan. Ghost, another ghost. Jesus, he knows me. Official video. Hopefully, I don't have to block it out. But, yeah, this is kind of a, um, a religious song, but from a kind of criticising kind of organised religion, which I'm all on board for, to be fair. I think Western Christianity has really lost lost itself. But anyway, yeah. Um, let's go. Give me an amen. amen. Damn right, amen. The Lord's coming for us, but he's only coming if we give him what he wants. Give, give, give. Thank you. The Lord thanks you. Jesus loves you. And Jesus loves your donations. Thank you. Seven. Yeah, take your money off people. Jesus, he sees your promise in heaven. It's Before we go on, it's funny that I'm listening to the Bible and that. It's funny that this, like, I'm well on board with this topic of the criticizing of take, the church is taking money from people. Because in the Jesus, I'm listening to the, basically the Gospels, really. Although I have got the Hebrew Bible as well now, but someone brings Jesus money and Jesus says, Who is it? Who is um who is on this coin you give me? And they're like, Caesar. He's like, Well give to Caesar what is Caesar's and give to the Lord what is the Lord's. So that literally is a clear thing from Jesus that he didn't want money because money is not God's. But yeah, let's go. Seize your promise in heaven, it's yours. For those who give, thank you. Thank you, brothers and sisters. Thank you very much. Singles, okay. Mm -hmm. You're officially defrocked. All right.
I love it. I love it. The tune actually banged as well. But this is the funny thing. There's a lot of people that would just jump and say that this is, yeah, sacrilegious. But if you ask me, this is the most pro-Jesus song and video I've seen. I think Jesus would agree. And a lot of heads is going to roll when Jesus does come back. Jesus is going to be fuming. Even down to when my mate got, well, when I went to my mate's funeral, and there was a CCTV in the church. I just thought, that's ironic. Right. Talk about love thy neighbour. Talk about God's watching over us. If you need CCTV, that means God ain't watching over you, which means you're doing something wrong. Yeah, I think this was the most pro-Jesus thing, and it's true. It's true. Yeah. But that's why, like, I find with, because I'm not an atheist anymore, but I also wouldn't say... Yeah, I wouldn't go to church. I wouldn't do none of that. Because there is a, I don't know. Like they said, there's a kind of phony, fraudulent thing that they're... Well, I'm not going to say they're all kind of like that. Do you know what I mean? I'm sure you've got good people in the church, probably a lot. But... Yeah. Yeah. Or I would like to know if there was backlash to this, because to me, like I say, to me, this is a very pro-Jesus thing. I do think Jesus would agree with this. Do you know what I mean? The one time Jesus lost his shit was when they was... Was it gambling in a church or something, or um, or selling things in the church or something? He went, Jesus went in there, smashed the place up. Do you know what I mean? He's fuming. Yeah, I thought this was great. I thought this was a great message as well. And like, Jesus is coming if we give, if you give enough. Do you know what I mean? It's like, yeah. I love that saying. I love that thing Jesus said. Who's and that's it? Whose mark is on that coin? Caesar's. We'll give to Caesar what is Caesar's, and give to the Lord what is the Lord's. <laughs> but yeah, yeah. I love this, and and like I say, the tune banged. I probably need to watch the, to hear the song again though, because there was some great words in there too. There was, um, I'm not going to be able to, there, there was one I oh, caught, cool. but yeah, no, this was a banger, this was a banger, but yeah, that's the reaction, sweet.